Hey guys, I'm gonna show you one of the top social media tools that you can use. This is one that I just think is absolutely fantastic. Now, why would you wanna use this? Well, let's say you go to the trouble of creating a YouTube video or creating content. You don't wanna just rely on Google to be able to index that and hope for traffic. You wanna be able to start you know, spreading the word by pushing it out to your social media. And I'm gonna show you how to do that in this video. All right, let's kick it off. So the tool I wanna to talk about, um, this is a, a buffer alternative, similar to Buffer, similar to Hootsuite, but it doesn't have a monthly fee. So I'm gonna show you what it is right now, and let's log in here. It's called Socimonials. And this is what it looks like. So this is actually where you would go forward and blast out what it is that you want to blast out on your social media channels, and it will track it for you all at once. So if you're the kind of person that wants to plan everything in advance and have all these pre-written blog posts, you can do that. You can also add things to a queue here. And what that is, is it will figure out what the best time uh, in terms of results for you to post is and post it at that time. And requeue is actually requeuing so that you can actually post the same thing out. So let's say you have evergreen content and you want to put that same thing out every like six weeks, you know, something that, that maybe it's your product, right? And you just want to kind of always be pushing that out, then that's a great way to do that as well. So we're going to send out a post here, but first I want to show you what, what I think is really cool about this is the reporting. So because it tracks everything, it will track the clicks from all these social networks automatically. So you just put in a naked hyperlink and it's gonna come through and you know track it all for you. What I like about this is it shows you that you're actually getting results because in a lot of cases, let's just kind of simplify this and uh, just look at Twitter for right now. But it's hard to gauge if you're getting traffic on Twitter, uh, let's say because you know maybe people will click on the link, uh, maybe they don't like it, you know, but they're clicking on the link. And that's what this shows here, right? So 521 clicks in the last, last 30 days, okay? What I like about that, and, and see only seven likes, right? So of the stuff that I've put through social monials, this isn't stuff that I've posted natively through like TweetDeck or Twitter or whatever. This is the stuff that I've posted through social monials. I have 521 clicks. Now what I like about that is I've got a metric now. I know how many uh, clicks that I've gotten on articles, uh, things that I've shared, links, and I wouldn't have thought it would be, been that high. But you know, if you can get 520 clicks over to your product, then that would be valuable to you. Um, think of how much that would have taken, that how much that would have cost if I was paying for traffic on Facebook or Twitter or you know one of these different ad platforms. So I think this is really valuable. What I love about social monials is right now, I don't know how long this will be going on for, but there is a deal at AppSumo so you can get a lifetime account for social monials, which is what I did. And I'll put a link to that in the description. Okay, you can filter by all these different things and you can you know, do it just by a custom date range um, or you could do it by a specific post, right? So this one on PayPal, um, let's see, I got 89 clicks on this. Um, and then let's pick out another one. Uh, let's see, cool wooden debit card. Um, I actually got 22 clicks on this and you know, I wouldn't have known that because no one liked it, but you know, people have clicked on it and it's driven results. So let's see how to, how to publish on social monials. So what you're going to do is you're going to post in your content right here. All right. So I got this posted in here and this is actually using a different, a different link tracker, but you know, I could just use it with a, a straight affiliate link. So it says here, it should be clear that 10 years from now, Bitcoin's gonna be worth more than it is today. Um, there's a fixed amount that, that creates demand. So this is the link uh, to the article. Okay, and I'll just pull that up for you. And you'll see here, this is actually just using Snipply, but what it does is it pulls in the link and then it puts my ad here, 
right? So that's what I like about Snipply, um, which is you can use for free and you can actually, you know, put in retargeting pixels through Snipply as well. I'll put a link to that as well in the description. So I'm gonna post this out and then the cool thing is there's a couple integrations. So you can integrate it with videos or you can integrate it with images, right? So I can go to free stock images and I can search Pexels or Pixabay. And, you know, because this is about Bitcoin, I can do a search and, you know, find something that, that I like. All right, so let's select this one and let's actually select another one. Um, let's do, and you can obviously upload your own uh, images. And let's select this one. Okay. And so this is the one that was pulled from the page. So I can actually remove that or leave it. And then what I'm do, gonna do is I'm gonna select which of the profiles I'm gonna post this to. I got LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter and then Instagram. Now I should mention with Instagram, um, you can pay for a service and have it go out directly or um, just natively with social monials, you can, you'll get a notification to your phone and then you just need to, it'll copy and paste everything for you and you basically just need to, to click a button to copy it and then paste it right into your, your Instagram account, okay? And make sure you're logged into the correct Instagram account in order to, uh, to do that. In addition to this, um, you can actually put in hashtags, okay? So you can see it's gonna give a preview of what it's gonna look like here. Um, I'm gonna use this hashtag tool and I got some Bitcoin um, hashtags that I've selected and I'm gonna uh, copy as a group. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a, a hashtag group. I'll just show you how to do that. Um, so you can create a hashtag group and I'm gonna just call it Bitcoin two and then I'm gonna paste those in, right? And let's say that, let's actually get a bunch more. Let's just uh, get some of these and then put it in there. So what it will do is actually pick uh, randomly four of these and then I'll copy and paste these over to here. And I can adjust it if I want, um, but let's say I'm gonna put six on Twitter. I'm gonna put five from Facebook and I'm gonna put four on LinkedIn. And so I'm gonna save that group. So now what I what I wanna do here is if I wanna insert that group, I can just select one of the groups and you'll see that it's added in right here, okay? Um, I'm just changing the, uh, the space here because I saw that it was cramped up and that's just because of, of copying and pasting. But anyhow, um, so we've got this all set up. We've got it selected to go to all these different profiles. You'll see with this one, uh, with Twitter, is it it actually um, you know shows me that I'm over characters. So I'm gonna have to manually adjust this one. When I manually adjust this, it's not gonna change the other ones. I do need to, uh, to adjust this. Biat, and then I'm gonna do control command space to bring up on a Mac, the emoticons, and I'm gonna put uh, money. So fiat dollars, okay? And what that does is that uh, brings up the, the emoticon. And so because I've already edited it here, it's not gonna change this on, on Twitter, right? So this will just be for this ones. And all right. So it allows me to preview what it's gonna look like on all these uh, different platforms. And you see it's, and this one is putting out three images. On this one, it's just gonna select the, the first image and then I'm gonna click publish now. And so what this is gonna do is this is going to publish now and push it out to all the social networks. So, you know, if you think, you know, you have an email list, you get a certain amount of clicks from that. This allows you to measure how many clicks you're getting from your social, platforms, right? Um, and so that's the thing that I really, really like about it. Um, and there is a deal on AppSumo right now where you can get it for a lifetime access. I'll put a link to the description, but this is an alternative to Hootsuite. This is an alternative to Buffer, um, to those paid plans where you can get something that's really effective, really robust, I've been using this for a couple months now. I've been really happy with it. Social Monials, it's just a better way to push your content out 
uh, socially. So now that it's, it's published, um, we're gonna see the, the verification report and you're gonna see um, exactly where, it, where it's posted. And you know, if I click on you know, this link here, I can see exactly what it's gonna look like, right? So this is exactly what it's gonna look like. Um, I can even uh, like it and uh, retweet it if I wanted to, um, make a comment. Do you own Bitcoin? All right, and boom. So that's how it works. Hopefully this video uh, is, is helpful and hopefully you see the value in using something like this. I do compare it to you know an email list so you can kind of track how many clicks you're getting. And I really like that about it. Um, and I think that this is a valuable arsenal because it, it really makes makes your social media you can see what kind of results you're getting you can see what people are clicking on and you know deep dive into the reports and see what kind of things that they're they're interested in and then post more of that stuff so if you have any questions reach out to me otherwise um, the link for social monials is in the description along with a couple other things and if you have any questions about marketing reach out i'll be more than happy to help cheers